So I've showed you how to use the old Porsche Chrono Pack in the Macan. So today I'll show you how to use it in the newer 971 Panamera or even in the Cayenne. If you like this video, I've got plenty more. Just look in our information underneath the video. Okay, so using the Chrono Pack in a Panamera 971, this is the Sport Turismo. So we're gonna just click on car. You're gonna click on Chrono. And it's simple as that. You can load a lap if you're gonna try and beat a lap. If you just wanna start it, you just press this button. And once you start it, it's gonna start recording. And it's up in there, the Chrono Pack. It's also in right, right there. You can see lap laps. And you can see I can do a lap there, a stop, intermediate times. It'll tell me the fastest lap on this current route. Okay, and then to stop it, you can either stop it from the steering wheel or you could stop it from the PCM. I'm just gonna stop it from the PCM. Simple as that. And if you wanna save it, you can. I'm just gonna reset it. Stop recording. Okay, let's analyze this. So basically at the top left, it's gonna say one R. I'm on lap one. It's gonna tell you how many yards I've recorded where it says 133. I'm 34 seconds in current lap. It'll tell you my fastest lap. Since I haven't done a lap yet, it's not gonna give you the fastest lap. It's gonna show how much fuel I've used. I haven't really used any. My range is 82 miles. And the remaining recording time is over nine hours. So it can actually record for a long time. You're doing something with fun. And at the top of the chrono, you can see it's just changing the time slowly. So you can actually load a map as well. So if you take it to a track, you'll know where the turns are and stuff. That does help honestly on the road it's a little bit of a gimmick but it's fun please subscribe and like our videos on mondays we're gonna try and do a dog video on tuesdays we do a food video on wednesdays we do either a car or a travel video thursdays we do a workout video thanks for watching and see you next time